Hey guys, it's Phoenix. If you look on the bottom left-hand corner, you should see that we're currently at 50% completion. Uh, I'm not going to bore you guys with uh, one of those really cute, cliche uh, speeches, because I've done that a lot before on my channel. But um, I just really want to thank everyone for supporting 500 days of this project. That's right. I just calculated it. In fact, I've been working on this project for 501 days. If you put that into perspective, that is almost one and a half years. That is 72 weeks, and I really don't even take any breaks. So I've been working on this continuously for so long with my incredible team, which has been shifting and changing every time. Uh, but a lot of them have stuck around, and all of you who've stuck around for so long, just thank you so much. Now I'm actually starting to see the finish line. So the light is finally starting to show, and I'm really excited, and I hope you all will stick around until the very end. So. What I'm going to do today is finally show you guys all of the starters. That's right, <laughs> I was going to show you guys the backs of them while I did that really corny speech, but that's really cute. We have the grass line, the fire line, and the water line. So, uh, sticking with tradition, a lot of you probably would have seen already the basic evolution. So, Ellerin right here, we've got Laviam, and we have Krillbard, which are obviously based on the Minecraft villain models. Uh, is very appropriate, that was something that I really wanted, just to keep that connection with vanilla Minecraft. This is Ellerin, uh, you would have seen this before. Ellerin evolves into Judalium, and Judalium evolves into Lunalium. And Lunalium now has that fairy element, last time it looked too much like humanoid. Uh, so, uh, we've done that. Bit of a change, but I think it looks really cute. There's the back of it, and there's the front. Now, Laviam, uh, obviously the Magma Cube, evolves into Levestal, and then Laviandal. This is nothing new. This was modeled a long time ago by Fizzy81, and it is a ghost slash fire type. And then finally, we have Krillbard, and Krillbard evolves into Calyx. Calyx evolves into Centricos, and this is by far my favorite. I think I'll probably choose the Waterline, just because of this amazing model by uh, Ninja. Wow. <laughs> That's... Looks really inappropriate. <laughs> uh, Ninja modeled this amazing Pokemon uh, and also modeled Calyx. So this is actually not a bug type. It is a water slash electric type. I think it does have that element. I'm really happy with that. Uh, but definitely one of my favorite models thus far. That's all I wanted to show you guys today because many of you wanted to see these starters. And these are the starters in great detail. <laughs> Looking at their hind. Uh, and I think many of you would... <laughs> no, I'm not going to go. Not going to say that. Anyway. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, and please do thank the crew, the Amazing Phoenix Projects crew, uh, for sticking around, working really hard on this project, and tolerating uh, my pressures, and I do push them a lot, I have to admit, but all in good measure, nothing personal, just for everyone to really see the fruits of their labor. This is what it is, and all the substantive material should be done in less than four months. That's the aim, and everything is working very well right now. Otherwise, these are all the models for the starters. These are your starters for Pokemon Co. 1 Amethyst. Have a look at them. Yet again, thank you. Subscribe for more creative content and Pokemon updates. I'll have a legendary Pokemon video coming out soon as well. Otherwise, take care.